Claire. Hey, what's up, guys? It's your boy. Not be hop here. Um. Oh, what the fuck was that? Today, guys. Can you hear that? <sighs> what is that? Well, hammer point back at it again. I'm not sure how I f how how I got how I got these informations, like how I figured that these guys are back at it again. Um, <clears throat> Maybe somebody gave me a link. Uh, if if you watched that video and um, I forgot, I'm sorry. It's over a week ago, and I have other stuff to do. Anyways, as you can see, after Math reloaded, woohoo! Nobody, I don't personally. I did never like after Math. Um, it was a bad clone of Infestation, and it felt like trash to me. Um, nonetheless, Artemis here. Let's just listen in real quick. Give me that hey strike, guys. Aftermath. Uh, I mean, Artemis Knives here, and I uh, got some exciting news for you all. So oh, he's so excited, guys! I want to make a quick little video. If you don't know what Aftermath is, this video is probably not for you. But uh, recently, uh, myself and a friend. Yeah, alright, he takes way too long to explain it. Him and his non existing friend thought. Hey, what's up, guys? It's your boy Adamith here. Blah, blah, blah. And they wanted to bring back a, a dead game. <clears throat> so, basically, the free-to-play model of the game um, was trash. So the game went down for obvious reasons. Um, their plan is to start a, you know, something like GoFundMe or whatever you, you call this shit. Kickstarter and bring the same game back and you just pay for it now as I said earlier <clears throat> as I said earlier they um, it's it's already more than one week ago that I, I, I figured that out on stream I think I, I think somebody on stream gave me a link to this shit um, and basically that was about 20 hours after that I actually um, went live so his video was up and I saw it about one day later. Not not totally one day, but almost one day. Um, so let's let's. They have a couple of goals here, really unrealistic ones. It starts with the first goal that this game actually goes back online. They want twenty five k, yeah, twenty five k dollars, and then it just gets ridiculous. Basically, the the first goal is just one server. For one year, they need one server for one year, and they want $25,000, you know. There is no server being that fucking expensive. One server, you know. It says, we will bring the game the game servers back online in one region. So that means if you are from America, and they say, okay, we're going to push a, an EU server live. You're fucked, dude. You're always going to play at 160 ping minimum. Or something around that, um, we will guarantee the online status of servers for one year and we will be able to bring servers up shortly after we reach this goal. So they want 25k to bring up the servers. <clears throat> and then, well, if you pay another tw if, if, if everyone pays another 25k, they add another region for one year as well. Then <laughs> they want to add a state-of-the-art anti-cheat for 150k. Blah blah blah. It's basically the shit. This guy's ain't that cheat. Private servers, etc., etc. And then here's six hundred thousand. You know, six hundred thousand for new buildings, and then another three hundred thousand for exactly the fucking same thing. So they basically thought, hey, let's make a million easy mode. But that's not the fucking point. It gets better. Are you ready? Now look. So you can click here. You can click here to back this piece of shit, enter some fucking email, and then you click whatever you want. <laughs> then this comes up. You know, their normal, their normal payment method they always use. 
Um, it's called Soul, Soul Lights, it's actually called. And then you can just pick whatever fucking thing happens, uh, whatever works for you. Cool story so far. So I was curious, here basically, in the video, um, uh, what that means? In, in his video, I'm, I'm just gonna explain it. If you want to watch his video, just go on his channel and watch it. It's Artemis Knives, you know. Um, basically, he says that his, he and his, like his friend and him, they had a good idea to bring the game back. So they talked to Rain Entertainment, which is Hammerpoint with a different name. Um, and basically, they want to do it, you know. So th it's basically like what Fredake is, do is doing right now. Um, he basically pays for the license, you know, he pays them um, according, uh, you know, so and so much percent every, I don't know, month. I don't, I have no idea, honestly. It's probably monthly or every year or some shit like that, you know. They just look, hey, okay, you sold $50,000, shit, you made $50,000, you give us 10% and then they get $5,000 for nothing. For just him using the, the base source code. Um, the, the base game so and he basically states something like yeah he's gonna do that and, and so on and so forth and um, he's some sh stupid ass whatever fucking job he has designer or something I think he said it's I'm just I, I have no idea I didn't watch the, the I didn't watch this video before I started recording this um, so I just you know I, th I have to think about what he said back in the day but that's appro approximate what he said. Um, so according to that, I would guess, or everyone probably that's going to look at this page is going to feel like, here, I've managed to reach an agreement with Free Rain and to, to gain full creative control over the aftermath. So if you hear that, it would sound like he is actually the owner of the game then, just like Fredek is, is of New Zealand. And you know, make money off of it, and he just pays money to them, right? Wrong. Fucking wrong. <laughs> so, as I said earlier, I clicked on that, and, you know, I, I started talking to the support of Xola. And uh, I made some accusations about, you know, this being fraud and shit. And uh, I got one of the agents to tell me where my money would go if I would actually fund this. Or if I would pay it. This is not a funding, you know. They're saying here they raise money. But basically they're not raising money. Anyways, I'm going to come to that in a, in a second. Um, if, you, if, you, if you give them money to in this button. If you press this button and then you pay $10 or whatever you pay. You're sending your money to Free Rin Entertainment. You're sending your money straight to Hammerpoint, and you don't get anything at that point. You you basically could just I give you my PayPal email, you just send me the money. Guess what? You could fucking refund this. You could charge it back on that shit. You can't. You can't. Want to know why? Because they have this man in the middle, the middle man, Xola, you know. So if you charge back, you're not charging back from Hammerpoint. You're charging back from this legal company, and they're gonna be like, "Why am I?" No, <laughs> you know, they 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 they're, they're gonna fight you on PayPal. I'm, I didn't do it, you know. I I actually funded ten dollars because I was curious if this number changes if you pay something, um, but it it actually changed, so that's pretty cool. Um, but you can't charge back. So I called these guys. I'm like, "Yo, nigga, give me a refund." No, they can't refund it. So, $13,000. It's been a week. You would say, wow, $13,000. Dude, that, that's, that's, pretty, that's pretty much, dude. Um, going to come to that as well in a second. 52% um, right now. So, yeah, they need another 11755 Um, It doesn't say any date, but... Long story short, you actually buy a product if you use, if you back the project. You're not backing the project. You're buying something. This is not like Kickstarter. On Kickstarter, you know, you, you back something. If the project happens, your money is gone. You maybe get something 
or you get nothing. It depends, you know. Um, but here, you, you don't get your money back, you know. So you could basically give them $10,000 and it would still be below 25K. And you don't get anything. You know, they're, they're like, yo, thanks guys, we got $23,000. Sadly, we did not even hit the first goal. Sorry, see you all in the next game, Infestation Reloaded. <laughs> I don't fucking know. They're not going to give you anything, you know. If it doesn't happen, they still keep the money. So let's say these 13,250, uh, 244.60 cents were legit. I'm going to come to that in a second as well. Let's say these were legit. All of that money was gone. All of that money was gone. Let's say they actually raised 13K. They would have 13K more than they had a couple days ago. And... Well. And then they're like, hmm, fuck you guys. But anyways, why did I say if this was real? Well, let's see when this video was uploaded. So it was uploaded on 9th March. That is 11, 12 days ago from today. So about two weeks. Yeah, I was, I was gone one week and that was a little bit beforehand. So yeah, almost two weeks here. And on the day the video was uploaded and the first time I saw this, so a day later, a day later after it was uploaded, this here had something above, a little bit above $12,000. So in the time span of two weeks, the game raised about, I would, I would guess, $500. Something like that. Maybe $1,000. Not, not $1,000 because it was already $12,000 something. I think it was pretty much at the end of the $12,000 in the, in the high numbers. But it doesn't matter. <laughs> it, matter of fact is in two weeks... It didn't even raise a thousand dollars. So, I mean, obviously it doesn't. If you have, if you, if you have only fifty, fifty, fifty dollars right here, dude. Do you know how long it's gonna take to actually reach a high amount? It's gonna take ages. Anyways, everyone who already paid money to these guys, <laughs> congratulations. You're just as much retarded as I am because, well, I did it as well, but it was only ten dollars. Shortly after I paid ten dollars, somebody actually bought a fifty dollar package because I saw I saw the number changing shortly afterwards. Afterwards, while I was still streaming. Anyways, guys, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Nice commentary and so on and so forth, right? Um, please be sure to back this project so we can reach twenty five thousand dollars, and we're all gonna see that this thing is not gonna happen because, I mean, with twenty five thousand dollars. Now you cannot afford a server for two for a year. You know? I mean let's actually calculate this. Let's see. So twenty-five thousand divided by one. No. Yeah. No. Hold on, how do I calculate? Doesn't matter gonna calculate it afterwards I'm too fucking tired it's 3 11 in the morning fuck you guys my pizza is almost done in the oven as well we're 13 minutes something in so my pizza is actually done since about 30 seconds I will see you guys in the next video hope you guys enjoy this shit fuck you and don't subscribe bye 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 Dad, mom get the oven out of the pizza did I say oven out of the pizza